morning guys and welcome to beautiful Amsterdam. The sun is shining, the tulips are out and I'm very, very happy to be here. Um, so I'm actually staying at this, I don't know if you can see the beautiful mural behind me and all the flowers, a rather jazzy hotel called the um, Van der Volk Sassenheim Leiden Hotel. I am not going to say it again, once is enough. <laughs> but uh, it's really fantastic because it's just, uh, well, it's not too far from the Kuchenhof Gardens, which is where you see all the amazing tulip displays, um, which which Amsterdam is famous for. Um, we're also going to be heading into Lies to take some pictures of the natural tulip fields. I'm sure you've seen them on Instagram, it's very beautiful. Um, and then we're going to just be spending a couple of days in Amsterdam Central, just kind of having a little wander around. But I'm going to try and give you lots of useful hints and tips during this video about how to get around, best time of day to visit the gardens, um, also good areas to shoot in and that kind of thing. So keep watching if you want some more tips and if you fancy doing this trip yourself. Um, so yeah, I'm going to show you a bit of the hotel as well because it's pretty spectacular. Um, so come with me. here at the Van der Volk Sassenheim Leiden Hotel. So I'm here in Amsterdam for a couple of days and I just want to show you an epic room tour. So we've got this huge bathtub with kind of views into the bedroom. It's rather romantic. Big, lovely, luscious bed here with kind of robes and, uh, and slippers. And then outside there's a, a cute little balcony where you can um, have a little coffee and look at the fields. And then we've got this beautiful kind of living room area um, with a, even like a working space and desk. And there's like tea and coffee and fridges and everything everywhere. But it's a gorgeous room and totally recommend it because it's not too far from cooking off gardens. hired a car for the day to drive us around um, because basically all of Lease is filled with these amazing fields. So this is the hyacinth field and I can't tell you how incredible it smells. You can smell the hyacinth, it's so beautiful, uh, but it's a really good idea to hire a car and then have a little drive around and see, see which fields you come, up, come up, uh, across. <laughs> I'm just so overawed and so like amazed. It's, uh, yeah, it's so beautiful here. I will give you is because it's actually really expensive um, getting around Amsterdam um, and, and kind of Netherlands in general um, and especially when we were doing the uh, shooting around the um, tulip fields and Kuchenhof. So we stayed at the Van der Volk Sassenheim Leiden Hotel which was amazing because it meant that we were nearer but even so you still have to kind of get an Uber or kind of make your way to the fields. So what we actually did was we hired a car, which was really helpful, and he drove us around. And because he was a local, he could actually stop off in, if we were like, we wanted to go to a pink tulip field or a, a purple hyacinth field, he could actually direct us in the right way, um, which was fantastic. So I highly recommend that. I think he charged us about 60 or 70 euros for the day, but it was totally worth it. So um, yeah, I would say definitely do that. Or if, you don't, if you're not carrying too much kind of camera equipment and stuff like that, you can also hire a bike. Uh, which is also a brilliant way to get around and then just kind of ask the hotel or ask around where the best fields are mm -hmm. so uh, yeah little hint and tip there so we've just arrived at Kirkenhof for the uh, we've got a little guided tour from the director and the gardener um, and then we have the dinner the Bolenius Michelin star dinner which is very exciting we're actually having it in the park um, so uh, come and join me Just arrived and the whole table is set. It's absolutely beautiful. There's flowers everywhere. 
everywhere, all around us. There's a beautiful string quartet playing in the corner, um, and we're about to have a six course tasting menu by Bolenius, which is the Michelin star restaurant here in Amsterdam. And I'm so excited. I just, I love it here. It's so beautiful, and it smells incredible. So come enjoy. It. That was literally the most amazing dinner. The food was just incredible. So I think my favorite thing was the rose starter. It was the beetroot shaped as a rose, but it was so delicious and so beautiful. Um, and all night we've had kind of, this is kind of sunlight streaming through onto the table, which is really pretty, surrounded by flowers, which is gorgeous, and a beautiful string quartet kind of playing lovely, soothing classical music. So it's just one of the most wonderful experiences. I literally have had the most amazing time and I highly recommend it. <laughs> so we've just arrived at Kuchenhof Gardens and um, basically we've got this like, amazing queue jump pass which means you don't have to wait in the queue um, which you can get on tickets actually which I shall put a little link at the bottom uh, but it's really beautiful like, it's quite busy I have to say it's four o'clock now and it's really busy there's lots of people around but we're gonna head straight to the windmill which is where um, there's like, an amazing flower display. Get through it. No, it's no problem, definitely. Yeah. Mel's <laughs> sure we're gonna get through it. So uh, yeah. And have dessert afterwards. Oh my god, I don't know about that. <laughs> so we're having a little wander around Amsterdam today and it's a bit nippy. Um so I've got my coat on. But um we're in the kind of museum area, so we've got the Van Gogh Museum over there, um, and then also the Moco, which is kind of like a more modern art one, and then the Rijks Museum over here. Um, but yeah, so you just come to this one area and there's, uh, it's quite handy because everything's when you come to Amsterdam is the famous uh, sweets and mayonnaise, so chips and mayonnaise. Um, and I'm standing outside one of the best places, which is called, I think it's called Virtual Pizza, but I don't know. I've probably said that completely wrong. So please let me know in the comments below how to, how to actually say that. Um, but we're gonna try the classic chips and mayo, which I'm very excited about. Um, but yeah, there's lots of other yummy things. So uh, we're gonna go, we're gonna head in. I'll let you know how it is. Okay, I'm going in. Here they are. I'll let you know. in Amsterdam. It's been so lovely. I absolutely adored the Kuchenhof Gardens and kind of doing all the photo shoots in the beautiful tulip fields. Um, and also it's just been really fun being in, in central Amsterdam as well, going to the Rijks Museum, trying the chips and mayo, going shopping around the canals. It's just been a really, really lovely trip. Um, 
but I hope that you've enjoyed it and um, I yeah, literally can't wait to come back. But uh, if you have enjoyed it, please leave me um, a like, comment, subscribe below. Uh, and that's all from Amsterdam. So over and out guys, bye. <laughs>